he was letting you know if you didn't get humble, if you didn't humble yourself before me. We got Blue on the hunt this morning. Welcome to episode 10 of What the Bitcoin. Let's go, girl. Deputy O'Day. Deputy O'Dan? Hey, O'Day. De O'Day. Yeah. Deputy O'Day, very nice to meet you this morning. What do you think about Bitcoin? Uh, it's the future. It's the future. Wow, how long have you had that perception to it? Um, probably just within the past year or so. How'd you get introduced to Bitcoin? Um, just self-exploration. Uh, really? Yeah, started investing and stuff like that. And then started teaching myself about cryptocurrencies. There, there he is. Oh my goodness, I gotta say, beautiful. And this was, what was his name again? Bono. Bono. Wow. Blue. Up. Up. Look at that. <laughs> Say hi to what? And it's uh, is it Officer uh, uh, Bono or just Bono? Just Bono. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and Deputy O'Day, um, what do you think Bitcoin looks like for the future, other than just being the future? Uh, yeah. So I think it's. I think it's basically just kind of a it's setting okay. up a a non-government controlled currency. Yeah. Um, but I also don't think it's going to completely take over because yeah. at the end of the day, what is Bitcoin valued off of? The dollar. So until that changes, yeah, it'll, it, it'll probably become more and more valuable, but I don't think it'll be the dominant world currency. Um, so it's just, it's gonna take a big change for that to happen. Joshua, very nice to uh, get your acquaintance and meet this morning. Thank you so much for your service, okay? My name is Joshua, today I'm joined with? Joshua. Really? Yes, sir. Hey, well, Joshua, I got to say, nice suit, man. Thank you. I like that shirt. The uh, the color combo is looking great. <laughs> hey, so uh, this afternoon, I was asking you about Bitcoin. What do you think about that? I know nothing about Bitcoin. Nothing? Nope. Have you heard of it, though? Of course. Okay, when's, when did you hear of it? Uh, it's been a couple years. A couple years, so 2017? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's been a couple years. Okay, and where did you hear from? Uh, just out and about, man. On the media or from friends? Yeah, friends, uh, online, different things. Okay, and then do you have any plans to invest in the future? Uh, in Bitcoin, I'm, I'm not too sure. I'd have to do more research. Okay, but you have other investments? Yes, sir. Okay. Hey, Joshua. Well, hey, it was very nice uh, meeting you. Beautiful class ring, by the way. Thanks, sir. Congrats on uh, graduating and best of luck with getting back to work, okay? Have one for day. Cleaned up here. Welcome to the channel, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, so I can like put this thing in gear, please. My name's Joshua. I'm joined today with Darren. Yeah. How's your Thursday, sir? Good. Doing good. Mm -hmm. Hey, Darren. What do you think of Bitcoin? Mm -hmm. Bitcoin? I don't know so much about. Have you heard of it though? Uh, I heard the name. You've heard the name? Yeah. To what degree? while well, back it says it'd be a good investment oh so you're, you're aware that it's an investment okay okay and then when did you hear about it about two years ago about two years ago have you heard about it recently prior to me bringing it up today no not at all okay and darren do you have any uh plans on investing in bitcoin in the future mm, might i don't know okay I'll do something about it. yeah yeah and then may do you think you'll do any research after speaking with me today yeah yeah Okay, and then what do you think the future of Bitcoin looks like for humanity? Well, I don't know too much about it. Okay. And then do you think this is a little outlandish, I understand, but do you think there's any chance that Bitcoin, the new emerging financial market, is influenced by God in any way? Uh, no. No? I no? I don't think so. <laughs> okay. And they're just like kind of copyright on the um, logo there, if you ask me. Right? So, my name is Joshua. I'm speaking with. This is Bobby. Bobby? Sweet. Yes. Hey, Bobby, I'm curious. Would there be any way that I could pay for my um, lawn and service care with Bitcoin? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm not really sure. That, I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah. I, We're not set up to pay Bitcoin, but I appreciate your call. Thank you, sir. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Thank you, Timothy. I thank you. It's a spirit. Does the Bible ever talk about something that's in line with Bitcoin ever? Like a new currency that comes or anything like that? I hadn't saw nothing in line. No? With that. Okay. It's just something that you done come up with. 
Uh, trying to reap the harvest. Yeah. Like we all are. But this is the way it goes. Yeah. The way it goes. Trying to come up with something to make the people run behind this the, to try to do a discovery on this. We're still participating in the rat race, even if it's that way. That's it, because there's not enough in it to really uh, to take you all the way to the top. It doesn't stem from faith originally, or right? That's right. That's right. It just, it just, it just something. It's, it's a temporary fix over here, just to put it in this here. And see just what you're going to get within a year, or you're going to get within six months, whether it'll be something that you continue to put money over in. Yeah, yeah. Can you, are you reaping? <laughs> That's it. That's it. If yeah. you don't reap, you have to come out of it. Yeah. The best thing a person can do now is just by putting his money in a house. Just buy a house. Real estate. Yeah. I don't get mad at me now. Looks no. like you don't like that. No. Well, I look at you. Look at your face change. I can See, appreciate the I can, honesty. I can, I can, I can, but I'm being honest with you. Yeah, no, I just I ain't got the lie to entertain you. I'm not trying to ask you to do that, sir. Well, I'm just telling you the way I feel about your faces. No, you, you don't have a lot of faces. But I did read in the Bible where people would have a lot of faces. I didn't see that in you. If it didn't, I wouldn't have gave you this kind of run. You had called about uh, Bitcoin? Yes, sir. And what, are you with a research, research company or are you trying to get a job done? No, I'm just, um, I, I'm a solo person that's just curious as to what your company's level of Bitcoin adoption was. Um, we had Elon Musk this morning, sir, announce that any Bitcoin transactions that come through for his Tesla model vehicles will not be converted back to United States dollars or whatever currency the country they were purchased in. He'll just keep it in Bitcoin. And I'm just curious as to what small businesses' opinions and adoption on that are now. How, how did you get our number? Out of curiosity. I was actually driving through my neighborhood, sir, and saw that you had a Liberty, I thought it was Liberty Mutual Insurance, and I'm actually in the market for that. <laughs> Yeah, we stole the logo from Liberty, yes, sir. Yeah, I was just curious. Okay, yeah, yeah, I just thought I'd call you back. I, I, you caught me busy a minute ago, but yeah, yeah, we haven't we haven't adopted Bitcoin uh, transactions yet, though. No. Yeah, do you have any plans on doing that, maybe at all, or or do you think the market may well, you, go that like way? You said it might be a problem because if, if you can't get if you get if Elon Musk is there, I don't know if the Bitcoin. I, I haven't really given a lot a lot of thought, to be honest with you. Yeah. No, so I mean, have you heard of Bitcoin prior to me bringing it up today? I'm sure you have, right? I've heard of Bitcoin. Yeah, it's like I heard it's like fifty thousand dollars for one coin. Yeah, you know, I think this morning it was about fifty-six. So yeah, right in that parameter. So you've heard about it in recent history, then? So it would be hard to do a transaction when I'm going to charge somebody forty dollars to do their lawn and where they get. Hey, so yeah, yeah, no, just a, just a quick, uh, and this is by no means a uh, patronism or nor an assumption of your um, level of knowledge toward crypto, sir, but you can, like, let's say I owned $100 of Bitcoin, correct? And my job was $100. I can send you $100 of Bitcoin. It's just going to be 0. 000 000 000000000 whatever, you know, I'm not very good at math, but you oh, can, I see. So you, yeah. So you can, you can send smaller. Yes, sir. You can't turn the TV on without a wreck, without an accident, without a shooting. Lord, I see why you say, separate yourself from the world. I see why you say, you can't serve two masters. You either hate one or love the other. And that was episode 10 of What the Bitcoin. Timothy, the gentleman that was saying a prayer there at the end of the video, actually spoke with Timmy today for three and a half hours. And the conversation was so intimate to a degree beyond anything of editing. One day I'll be able to bring that footage to you guys, but at this point in my channel, where the world is currently even at, it is not time for it yet. I ask that you guys still stay tuned, wait for these upcoming episodes of What the Bitcoin, but what's looming and coming into the future is gonna be much more than that, I can feel it. Like, comment, subscribe. I look forward to bringing you guys more content in the upcoming days that we all get to share together. Thank you and stay safe.